is actually really bloody hot. Do you remember what this looks like and how pretty it is because it's about to go not that way at all. It's probably the most like vegan for autumn breakfast I think I've ever posted online before. I'm not mad about it. I thought we could do another full day of food today because it's been a hot minute since I've done one. And I'm actually going on holiday tomorrow with my sister to America, which I will take you along with me, obviously. But it means that I have a lot of food in my house that I need to use up. And so that is what I will be doing today. I've got a lot of errands to run to. Obviously, if this wasn't clear, this is porridge. I don't think you've seen me eat porridge in ages. It's mainly because I have bread and I have peanut butter. I don't have any jam. I have a few errands to run today. I need to go pick up my antidepressants and get some few things before I go away on holiday. I actually haven't had my antidepressants in like three days. Though I couldn't get them renewed time. Obviously I'm not suggesting that this is not a good thing. <laughs> um, but I am going to go pick them up today because I need them ASAP Rocky. Plus I also need them obviously before I go on holiday so I can take them with me. I hope everyone's doing well. I also have coffee obviously. This is actually my second coffee of the day but it's actually kind of like half a coffee because I don't really, I've got a really bad habit of, this is so boring, of not finishing my coffee. It's now gone cold. Like, see, 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 that's what I'm saying. Okay, I'm gonna eat this and I will Beyond my merry way. Beyond? Beyond my merry way. Hello, it's me again. It's now like 1.32 ish and I'm so hungry. I did my errands, I got my antidepressants finally. I don't know if I said earlier that I didn't manage to get them over the weekend because the prescription wasn't done in time. So anyway, I'm all antidepressed up. I got some bleach because we're gonna do some re-bleaching before I go on holiday and I've been packing. Are you zoomed in? No, we're not. So my room is more of a mess than normal. We're gonna go make some lunch now. Now, one of the like key things in my life <laughs> at the moment is making things that are quick, easy, cheap preferably, because we are in a cost of living crisis. And I don't know if you've noticed, but I've had no brands, <laughs> no brand deals recently. So I don't have that much money. So a lot of my, food at the moment has been very cheap very easy very quick because also your girl has some rocky times mentally so i've basically just been trying to focus on meals that are yeah quick and easy um i actually am starting a tiktok series on tiktok obviously i'm calling mental illness meals um because literally some days i can't even be bothered to, to cook for longer than 10 minutes and what i'm gonna make for lunch it takes longer to cook but i'm literally just putting everything in the oven and just letting everything come together so let's go Oh, it's bright in here. Let's pause this. I've got it so loud as well. So for, where can I put you? You know what that'll do. So for lunch, I have some, like one potato left. So I'm gonna use that because I obviously don't want that to go moldy before I go on holiday. And I think I'm just gonna make like a cubed potato tomato thing, you know? Just mm. put it all in the oven and just let it all come together and work. So I'm currently parboiling some potatoes. Or a potato because I only have one left. Which should probably be fine now. I made the best potatoes the other day. Like they were incredible. So I'm gonna kind of repeat the process. This is like the longest part of the whole cooking, I would say. Taking the potatoes and making sure they're dry. And then we're gonna just basically fry them in the oven. We'll put them in the oven. I'm literally just putting everything that I think will make a good vibe in there. Okay, literally just put potatoes, tomatoes, and chicken and basil all together. And we're gonna put it in the oven and just see how long it takes. Oh, it's really dark, sorry. And now, wait. Okay, I can't be bothered to wait any longer. Mm. If I had cheese, this would be perfect. But alas. So I love pickles too much not to include them in this, but I appreciate that's probably a little, maybe a little bit weird. Maybe it's not though, actually. Mm.
Okay, so I've also, so I'm back in bed, I'm in my room. Um, so I put some, a little bit of tahini on it, and I also have this, which is my, my opinion. Wait. In my opinion, I don't love mayonnaise that I'm about to use. It's a Leon mayo, vegan one. In my opinion, this is nowhere near as good as like the standard Hellman's one, but you know, it'll do. I'm gonna take a bit of that. So ta was by obviously taking a while to cook. This was literally easy. I just put everything in the pan. Even the pickles go to be honest. I don't know why I was hitting on them. Look. Mm. The chicken pieces I use are like they're from Iceland. They are my favourite ones, they're a bit pricey. So I always get them I try and get them when they're on offer, but this is exactly what I needed. Crikey. I'm gonna have this and oh here's a chicken piece close. I'm watching a YouTube thing. Um, I just wanted to reiterate just how good this is. Like, I'm getting through this so quickly, and I wish I had more. I mean, you can't go wrong with potatoes. Mm. I feel like you're going to think I've done absolutely nothing today, because every time I've spoken to the camera, I've been in the exact same position. But, I mean, how much have I done today? I don't know. I've just bleached my eyebrows, which is why... Well, well, I've got no eyebrows, um, but I'm gonna have dinner soon, but I just wanted to show you my fun Newest fun thing in my life is my jar of sweets and I have filled them up as much as I can um, Actually, I went to a I went to a buffet with my brother and dad yesterday And it's one of those like around the world ones and they had all of these lollies and so obviously I got my money's worth just in lollies so every time I was going back and going up to get some food I brought back like 10 lollies with me but hey oh um but then there's just loads of like vegan sweet things in the bottom so the reason I show you this is because firstly how amazing to have a fun little sweet jar in your room and also I've been eating these non-stop <laughs> throughout the day my favorites are these like little wait, actually, these little like blue raspberry ones wait this is what we're consuming before Dinner and then me and one of my flatmates cook some food together with some of my leftovers. We're gonna have pasta and then we're gonna watch RuPaul. Um, so I need to finish packing because this place is absolutely chaotic. I hope you're having a good day. Is it gonna have sound? No. <laughs> Tell me where the garlic part is. There literally is like a gap where the garlic bread should the garlic should be. Oh, this is an abomination.